Hi, so I have two of the wireless Qi charging anchor devices here and for weeks I was researching to see which one was better but then I just decided to buy both so one in my living room and one in my uh, nightstand bedroom um, but because I struggled uh, for a week to decide which one I wanted to buy I wanted to demo it and show you the pros and cons of each one so here I have an iPhone 10 and a LG G6 and I'm gonna demo it using those two phones with these Anchor wireless Qi charging. So both of them were very highly rated and had over 600 to 900 positive ratings on Amazon.com. And um, I, I do want to address the charging speed. So the charging speed for both of these are the same. So I don't have one of those fast charge plugs. And so I am using a normal plug. And what I mean by normal plug, for example, is this socket here is just a normal Sony plug. There's there's nothing special about this. It's not the $20 fast charge ones. And using one of those, these two phones that I, and I've tried both of these phones for about 3 weeks now. And I've had both of these for 3 weeks is um it charges roughly timing it it charges roughly uh 25% every hour. So that's not too bad. Um, especially if you know you're just coming home from work or you know you're just going to bed and, and you're just lying it down like that you know for the most part you're just um, char uh, you know, you, know you're, you, don't, you don't have to do necessarily a fast charge but also 25% uh, every hour is not too bad now um, that's the charging speed as far as these cords so these cords that it comes with, they're both the same length. They're 34 inches in length in case you want to know whether it'll fit on your um, uh, sort of a work desk or nightstand. That's how long the cord is. This does have a non-slip and the non-slip, uh, for example, there's a non-slip in the bottom and you'll see a, there's a lot of dust and all of that trapped in the non-slip. It's a rubbery surface. So there is a rubbery surface here. And when I was buying this, deciding whether to buy this or not, one of, one of my concerns was, oh, is, is my phone going to just sort of slip off? Well, not really, because it is very, it, it is a non-slip surface and it's rubbery. And so it, it grips and hangs onto the phone pretty well. And, and this is a fairly slippery phone here. And same, same with this particular phone. You, you know, it, it grips it pretty well. So this particular coaster style one does have a non-slip and this particular one here you'll see is um, just all plastic. There is no non-slip because it just, you know, it, it just goes in like this. The other concern I had with this particular upright one was that it'll tip. So, so it doesn't really tip and, and the reason why you, you notice is because this electrical outlet extends all the way here and you know how can it really tip it, it doesn't really you know you, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to push it really roughly to, to actually have it tip so it doesn't tip there is a rubbery surface in the bottom here also where you see it also catches a lot of dust um, but for the most part there you know there is no tipping here and and you could throw I don't want to say throw but be a little bit rough with your phone and it's not gonna tip and um, you know, I was concerned about that because I read some comments on Amazon that said it was going to tip and it doesn't tip. Um, and it doesn't really tip in reality. Um, the other thing also is um, I do have both of these in the links in the description area of the video if you want to uh, buy these. The, um, um, now, there are some pros and cons to each one. For example, this coaster one, you actually have to know the sweet spot of your phone. So, for example, I am going to put my iPhone here and you'll notice that that light turns on indicating that it's charging. Now if I am off by say, you know, off centered, you'll notice that the light turned off meaning it's not charging anymore. So you really do have to know the sweet spot of your phone generally in the center um, in order for uh, you to place this properly in the right orientation and uh, have it charging. So you notice once again that uh, this is off. And if I place it in the center, it generally turns on and it's charging. Now, both of them can handle a thick case. So you'll notice I have my caseology case here. And it's your typical sort of um, 
four millimeter, five millimeter case here. So I'm gonna put this on the center and you'll notice once again, it turned on. So when it turns on, you'll, you'll notice um, it is generally again in the center. Now it depends on your phone. So for example, with this LG phone, it doesn't have as wide a surface area for the charging. So you really have to be a little bit more precise with it being in the center. Um, and that's the charging phone for my phone. Um, now for the anchor, you can't go wrong with this because there's actually two coils. There's a coil in the top and a coil in the bottom. And so for this, I could charge it by putting it landscape or also by putting it upright. And the reason for that is sometimes you want to watch something on your phone. So, so it's a nice upright position where you could watch a YouTube video, for example, just by having it lying on the side here. So I've been adjusting it and the charging sound's been going on in my phone. That's what you're hearing. Now, the other thing here is the light. So I like that the light is non-intrusive. And, and you'll notice that the light is, you know, just a blue light here and a tiny blue light there. You know, it's, it's not the bright lights that you see in the other Qi wireless brands where there's, there's like a full light that comes out. And the reason why I like that is it saves electricity um, because it's always plugged in. Um, but also that, uh, you know, if you have it on your nightstand, you, you just don't want that light there. Um, so let me see. There's other... Uh, items that I have, uh, but I think that's it. That that's really what I wanted to cover with this, with, with these two Chi, one the upright and the other the coaster brand or, or the coaster style. So these are the anchor, and let me just give you a close up view here of you know how it looks. So this is the close up view. And this is the coaster version. And I'll, I'll have to clean this because it's, you know, really just, uh, you know, a little bit dirty there. Um, but, I mean, that's really it. And, uh, you know, I hope this helped. And please subscribe. And thank you for watching.